I find, Ian and Courtney, that often people say the phrase, that's what it's all about. And it turns out that what they're referring to as what it's all about is actually, in fact, not what it is all about. That's what it's all about. There it is. Uh, like, you know, it's all about good cleats before a game. You're like, no, it's just not, that's not even close to what it is, quote, all about. So for me and my family and our home, it's about a life of purpose and meaning and following Jesus. And this holiday right up there with Easter is just about as exciting as it gets that, that God loved us so much that it became a man that he entered the world as a humble baby in a place that no one expected anyone of importance to come from um, and lived a life of unbelievable adventure and invites us to a life just like that of adventure and, and purpose and meaning and risk and danger and excitement and eternal impact. And that's what we're celebrating at our house, the baby Jesus, the Christ child, that God loved us enough to become a man, to live a life with a perfect example for us and to die uh, and pay a debt that we all owe. That's what I believe. Um, and it's, it's the most incredible thing. So we talk to our kids a lot around this season about the anticipation that God's people had leading up to this moment where he enters the world. He humbles himself to be a man and enters the world. That's what we're celebrating. I hope you get a piece of that. I hope you get some of that. If you've ever liked to talk about that, I'd love to talk with you. Otherwise, I hope it's this joyous time at your home. We're going to get into it here in a second. 